pinwheel signifying the innocence of children. We're stuck in the ground here to show the number that were abused and neglected last year in Fairfield County. A total of 1,864 plastic colorful wheels are planted in front of Ripawan Middle School. The hope for the display being there now is just to raise awareness and we're hoping that people will realize that even though we live in Fairfield County, there are children suffering from abuse and neglect in this county every day. Kids in Crisis, a nonprofit organization dedicated to helping children and families in need, call this display Pinwheels for Prevention. It's something that we started doing a few years ago uh, where we're acknowledging Child Abuse Awareness Month with a pinwheel display. The agency's Youth Corps, a group of volunteer high school students from the Fairfield County area, spent their time setting up the pinwheels this past Sunday. It shows a real passion and dedication on the part of these kids and a lot of caring. Um, you know, for them to give up four to five hours on a Sunday for an event like this, I think says a lot about their commitment to the cause. Since 1978, Kids in Crisis has helped 107,000 children and families. Last year, 131 children stayed with the organization and over 5,000 were served. The hope of the people at Kids in Crisis is that an end will be put to childhood abuse and that events like this will no longer need to take place. In Stanford, Christina Chiarelli, itsrelevant.com.